Okay, I am talking about the French Revolution. I'll start by just listing the circumstances of the French Revolution. Um, the embrace of the Enlightenment, particularly the French brand of Enlightenment thought, was a significant circumstance that contributed to the outbreak of the revolution in France. The Enlightenment teachings and ideas embraced democratic self-determination and sought to remove monarchical power in favor of one where the greater individual voice was evident. Enlightenment ideals of equality and individual rights were proposed via the Enlightenment, which was different from thinking in the time. I'm going to move on to the expressions. There's really only one big expression of the time that I not necessarily sparked the revolution, but was a factor in it. The French government was deeply in debt. It attempted to restore his, its financial status through unpopular taxation schemes, which were heavily regressive and also not very liked among the people. The outcomes, the French Revolution completely changed the social and political structure of France. It put an end to the French monarchy with the execution of King Louis the 15th, 16th. Couldn't, can't read Roman numerals like that, Mr. Burke. Um, feudalism and took, took political power from the Catholic Church. So those are the circumstances, expressions, and outcomes. What ways was the revolution a success or failure? Okay, I'll start with the fail, the fa failures. Um, it provided an unstable government. The peasants would perform violent protests, which weren't even protests. They were just basically acting out in violence via their anger. Obviously, the reign of terror. It was the first of many revolutions. The other... One other was in 1830 that came, and then 1848. Um, and then, obviously, Napoleon comes next after this revolution and is an absolute ruler, which kind of goes completely against the French Revolution and its thinking. Um, but here's some of the successes. It overthrew an absolute monarchy, got rid of one, kind of replaced it with another, but we're not going to talk about that. Um, it provided religious, religious tolerance for the people. There was an emergence from the middle class or of the middle class. And citizens gained the right to vote. And they also gained free speech. And that is all that I have on the French Revolution. Um, thank you for watching and I will see you later.